Hi everyone! In this video we're going to look at Revlon's new Just Bitten Kissable Balm Stains. And please excuse my voice, I have a little cold so it might sound a little strange. These new products, they come in 12 different shades and they're sold at your local drugstore. You can probably also find them at Ulta. And what these are, Revlon says that they are lightweight lip stains that are also lip balms, so they're supposed to soften your lips and also give a little bit of color that adheres for, Revlon says hours and hours, who knows what that means, but if it's a stain, it should last on your lips longer than a typical lipstick or lip gloss would. At my local Rite Aid, these were $8.99, so basically $9. This week, this is Memorial Day week for 2012, Rite Aid is having a 40% off sale, so if you're interested in these, I would encourage you to go get them right away so that you can get a 40% discount. So, like I said, these come in 12 shades. All of the shades will be shown in this video. The colors from left to right are Charm, Precious, Honey, Darling, Cherish, Sweetheart, Lovesick, Rendezvous, Romantic, Smitten, Crush and Adore. That bright orange color Rendezvous was the most difficult to get a hold of. I'm not sure if it's because of the approaching summertime season with orange being a really popular color and so more customers are drawn to that or if it's just a coincidence. But if you're kind of interested in this color um, or even just on the fence, it may be a good idea if you come across it to pick it up Anyway, um, just because if later you decide you do want it, it may be a little hard to get a hold of. All right, let's move on to swatches in this video. And as always, please check out allurebeauty.com. This time I will do a post with swatches for each of these colors so you can see up close photographs. And I will also, of course, show you what the color looks like on the lips. And then I think I will do a review for each color separately so that you can also see more in-depth details about individual colors that you may be interested in. In terms of the packaging, they come in these plastic pencils and the base does twist up. So you can twist them and then you get more product there. All right, so the first color is Charm and this is a pale peach color. Second is Precious which is just a really nice nude. Precious does have silver micro glitters, but you really can't see them, they're so tiny. Third is Honey, and this is a mauvish pink. Fourth is Darling, and this is more of a purple toned lilac color. It's a little deeper than a lilac. Next is Cherish, which is a more pink version. Still has purple hues to it. So it's kind of a mix of a bubblegum pink, but it has this tint of lilac to it also. Sixth is Sweetheart. And this is a magenta pink. So some of these colors do have that micro shimmer in it, silver. So these colors here, but really they all leave a glossy stain to the skin, so it's pretty hard to tell which ones do and don't have that inside them. Sixth is Lovesick. And this is more of a fuchsia pink. The shimmers in this one are slightly more noticeable, but again, practically on the lips, I don't think you'll really be able to tell. Seventh is Rendezvous. This is an orange, slightly coral color. Third is Romantic. This is a red with a little bit of a brick hue to it. Next is Smitten. It's more of a berry tone color. Eleventh is Crush. A deeper wine color. And last is Adore which is a brownish red. All right, so there you have Revlon's 12 new Just Bitten Kissable Balm Stains, available at your local drugstore or Ulta 
for around $9 each. Now from just swatching on my skin, I can tell that they do have this menthol smell. So there's probably something like peppermint or menthol in the balm. I'll let you know in the written review on Allura Beauty whether it tingles on the lips. I'll also let you know how long wearing these actually are. They are supposed to stain the lips slightly, so I'll tell you how many hours the color wears until it starts to fade. They are very smooth in texture, and they apply very nicely onto the skin. No tugging, no real pressure that you have to apply in order to get the color to transfer. The colors themselves are pretty pigmented. They are still a balm quality, so they're not super opaque, but they do have a strong color payoff, and you get a wide variety of colors from nudes to pinks to more purples to even rendezvous which is that corally orange color. Alright, if you have any other questions that I haven't answered either here or in the written blog then I will be happy to answer it. Sometimes people ask questions that I already answer in the video or in the blog post and I think from now on just because it's getting to be so overwhelming to try to answer all these questions. If you ask a question that I've already answered in the video or somewhere in the description box or the post, I may approve the question but I just won't take the time to answer it just because, you know, I, I have addressed it somewhere already and it takes me so long to go through all the questions and all the comments and answer them individually. Um, so just to let you know. There is a giveaway going on for Max Hey Sailor Highlight Powder in Crew on the blog, so make sure you go and check that out. You can also enter by just subscribing to the YouTube video and that will qualify you to win one of the two highlighting powders that I'm giving away. So go ahead and enter that and good luck. I hope you enjoyed looking at these with me. Thanks for watching.